welcome to my channel my name is Lydia Essenam and if you're new to this channel my dear this is a community of genuine relentless people and we want to see everybody grow and win so why not join the family by subscribing and liking the oh, video so, so you feel cool yes. you started a family mm -hmm. and all of that how has it been building a family here oh building a family here hmm um it's good and challenging yeah um good in the sense is that you know my kids are born here they have uh, better opportunities in life mm -hmm. uh, compared to kids growing up in ghana yeah. i mean i remember myself we're growing up in ghana and uh playing on the streets you know? <laughs> i know right i remember me and my friends and my cousins we used to go out to the junkyard and we look mm -hmm. for um things uh, kinds of you know to make cars with and stuff like that yeah and while i cherish that lifestyle mm -hmm. you know going out and fishing for good fishes in the gutter i remember <laughs> I those know, things right, right? You play gutter to gutter. <laughs> <laughs> um i like those because they were part of my identity yeah but i also feel like seeing my kids here and and how they get different type of plays different mm -hmm. type of opportunities different types of um growth yeah um, um you know lying the path which is their goal um it's 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 a blessing to see them right yeah. in that an environment where kids um can grow up without you know uh, going hungry exactly. like, you know what i mean yeah. there's food all the time there's things happening all mm -hmm. the time or, you know um you're not going to bed hungry you're not you know having to do a so, all sort of dirty things in the yeah. street in the name of playing right um the kids go out they play in the backyard um, I can let them go without supervision, do their thing, because yeah. they're still within my property. Yeah. They're yeah. still out here. Um, they can get lost because they have to come through the house exactly. to go out, right? Yeah. Um, Ghana, we just leave our kids there roaming the streets. <laughs> it's fun. It helps them grow. That's yeah. what I was talking about, the independence. It's the independence right? factor, they, yeah. They, they grow and become independent, but at the same time, the dangers yeah. of, of living on the streets mm -hmm. as, as children. Um, yeah. It's good. Um, the other part of it for me is basically, you know, when your children comes to become like teenagers, mm -hmm. it's really harder here controlling them and yeah. directing them on the right path than in Ghana. Ghana, I have when some you messed up, I was like, you friends right here, around. like exactly, it's totally you know, different. It's totally as teenagers, different, right? Yeah. So yes, uh, family here is good, um, but raising a family is a little bit harder. There's rules and. I get it that sometimes in Ghana, um, the way we were disciplined was basically abused, right? Mm -hmm. The way we you get beat up for no reason yeah. and stuff like that. I don't I don't subscribe to that, but I also believe in um, certain amount of discipline to yeah. correct kids and put them in the right way. Mm -hmm. And the certain things that makes it very difficult to grow uh, to, to to discipline kids in mm -hmm. the right way here. Yeah. Um, those are the parts that I hate, but I just love the fact that. There's opportunities when children go to school. Um, I don't have to worry about, you know, education is free for free, free yeah. free, all the way up to university yeah, level. Yeah, that's good. Um, yeah. And, and that's good, right? Um, I know we talk about basic education in Ghana, yeah. but not the same, right? Mm -hmm. Education is free here. You don't have to worry too much. Whether you have the money or not, your kid can go to school yeah. all the way, right. even to the university, if, if, if you have the opportunities that they can mm -hmm. go as far as they want. Um, whereas in Ghana, when you get to the university level especially yeah um it becomes tag of war mm -hmm. right yeah um, thinking whether you find a job whether you, you find a job or you finish or not <laughs> right even even entrance right yeah. Yeah, entrance into the university i know you have to write all these um exams and yeah, stuff to, yeah, to get you know entrance, entrance exams. exams and all that stuff uh well you don't have to do that here mm -hmm. right uh, if you want to go you will go yeah. whether you if you want to go to university you will go there's yeah. all the opportunities are there for you to go if you mm -hmm. want to go to college you will go if you want to go to if even if you don't want to spend um two years or even the four years in the university mm -hmm. um, there's community colleges where you can go for a one-year college course okay. right which yeah. helps you grow so the opportunities for uh children to get the education they need yeah. is exist here for everybody it's, yeah. it's basically equal opportunity if you want to take the opportunity right mm -hmm. so many people don't take the opportunities that are present here exactly. um, just because you know convenience and stuff makes things look cheap mm -hmm. but uh, coming from ghana um <laughs> it's the best you can much, ever have <laughs> yes exactly you, you know um it's the best you can it's ever have just looking at the fact that if you want to go to school however mm -hmm. high you want to go mm -hmm. 
there is support systems here that will allow you to achieve that. You don't yeah. have to be a rich man's kid to, to get the best education. Yeah. You know yeah. what I mean? That That's part of it. Mm -hmm. uh, makes me glad that my family is here. Mm -hmm. right? uh, at certain times, I feel like send them to go and let them go and learn street smartness. But you can't. No, so that's man. the thing. Yeah. <laughs>